What's good, YouTube? It's your boy DJ Medi Major Man back again. Another video, man. This was a little bit different, right? I know you're used to me, and I've been kind of getting into and responding to rap, hip hop, everything going on in that sphere. But if anybody's been on this channel long enough, you know I've had a couple arcs per se, right? When it comes to uh, the content on this channel. Um, for one, <laughs> uh, it started off as a sneak review channel. Right, so without diving into the full history, you can go back and watch because the video is still up. Sneak reviews, um, gear reviews, Miami Hurricanes football stuff. Shout out to the U. You already know how that go. A podcast uh, where I want to kind of en enable and expand my my ability to mix, but because of copyrights, I can't get into all that. But some something's in the work you know what i'm saying something's in the works but i'm i've been actually asked by some people privately um to get back into it and what are my thoughts on some sneakers as you can clear well, point this up as you can clearly see i'm still very much into sneakers <laughs> that's not something that i stopped doing um some of my best videos on this channel came from doing sneakers so people kind of ask me like, hey, are you done? I mean, you could see the background. Obviously, I'm not. There's some stuff from a few years ago, more recent stuff. So I shout to Future, shout to Kendrick. I'm like that when it comes to the sneaker game. Trust me. And this is a small glimpse. If I go outside this room, it's a lot more, right? Boxes on boxes, right? But the sneaker game... Um, comes with a lot of politics, right? The emergence of bots and things like that just kind of drew my passion away from it. The reseller market makes me sick to my stomach. Um, I really have a hard time making sense of it. But I do like that some of these companies have worked to make their stuff more accessible. Not everything. Nike. But some stuff is accessible. I say all to say, um, this pair that I'm about to, as you can probably tell from the title, obviously what it is. But I like I like to give you all some context because once again, I said I'm, I'm like that. I've been doing this. Military blue, right? For those who know me, what is it? 2024. I mean, 12 years ago. I think June 9th, so almost a year to the, what, 12 years to the day, I got this pair. Now, the light's going to do it justice, possibly, but as you can see, I clearly wear my sneakers. This is the military blue as I know it. I wear them. I've worn them quite often. Um, That's both pairs, as you can see. <laughs> I wear my sneakers. These these definitely got beat up. I had zero. Oh, and let you know how valid I am. Look, you might be able to receive it. This is the Foot Locker receipt. And when I cop, and you could probably see the date on it. It's faded. But, yeah, uh, June 9th, 2012. See the camera focus that. Yeah, there you go. Cause we don't do raps on this channel if you're a rap person hey shout out to you no i'm not hating on your game but that's just not what we do and so um i actually copped this pair of shoes the updated version out of frustration i went to go get the travis scott's like i'm sure every sneaker head to hype beast in the world did and i felt really good if you know me you know that i have been successful on exactly zero Travis Scott's I will not pay retail I mean excuse me I will not pay resale I will not pay uh for reps it's just not me no shoe is that important to buy a an unauthorized reps however you want to spin it if I didn't get it officially from Nike it's just not my thing right um I went and put my information in just try for these. I did not, I didn't hit on the uh, shock drop, but I just tried for these. I have hit on shock drop drop before, 
but on these I said why not so I think it's interesting there's been a lot of controversy in the uh, sneaker community about these the box get that out of focus come on yeah there we go clearly say military blue clearly says military blue but these are known as the industrial blues because of some controversy things going on overseas some conflicts i'm not going to get into but people don't want to call it that sneaker has a con this military blue because these these go back i do not have the 06 pair of the military blues i do not have the 89 pair of the military blues be no reason to i was a i was an infant when those came out but i got these and the first thing i noticed this is new i don't know if they're cutting costs but here you go right there we good uh but the first thing i noticed is that there's no actual like this is this is normally a chain not an actual like plastic hang tag so that's a matter of fact i got one right here I don't know where this is from. It just happened to be hanging out on my desk, but that's new. Now I see, I saw a TikTok of some people hating on people who had these. Um, a couple was walking around in a park with them, like a amusement park, and they were making fun of the individuals. Um, I guess for wearing the shoes a particular way. So, comparatively, I should have liked to get these. Obviously, one got the Nike Air in the back. The other has the Jordan brand logo. Both have Air Jordan in the tongue. Laces. Uh, maybe it's the light not doing these justice. Oh, yeah. There's, a de there's definitely different hues of blue. This is clearly... And a lot of the sneakerheads are conflicted. They think this is the real military blue. I side with their argument. Might be controversial, but I just do. Um, anywho, I got these out of frustration and I was pissed off. And I expected not to hit on these. I don't know if that was Nike giving me their... Which tends to happen a lot, obviously, with Nike, but... Um... My thoughts on these. Solid pair. Obviously, you can see mine's a beat up. I will never go against a Nike Air beyond the back because that's a sign to the OGs. And it's how Nike keeps getting people to buy the same shoes over and over again. Because I can't tell you how many pairs of shoes, particularly fours, I have. That... That's a pair of threes, the true blues right here. But um, yeah, and sneaker lore and sneaker culture, if you don't buy a pair of fours that have Nike Air, you're not valid in some places. <laughs> if it has a Jordan Air in the back, you're not valid. I mean, I don't know what to tell you, man. I, I think it's all just a plot to just release the same shoes and get sneaker lovers to keep buying them over and over again. And to get the younger generations and kind of keeping that perpetual cycle. I mean, but that's another video for another day. Uh, all in all, uh, these are a solid pair of shoes. I like the OG box. Obviously, you can never go wrong with that. I don't have room in these boxes for these. So, I'll probably just end up keeping them in the box. I'll be completely honest with you. Um, because I own a pair of these that I actually wear. I may just clean these up and just keep wearing these. As you can see when the light hits them, they're not totally shot just need a little tlc a little white down man um i'm not a big rock one of the rock one of the stock guy so we'll see I'm, like i said i don't support reselling but maybe i'll do a giveaway maybe some lucky young co-worker of mine will get their hands on these i don't know that's neither here nor there but it's my thoughts, man. Solid pair of shoes. If you like them, cool. Rock them, man. Wear your shoes. If you don't like them, it is what it is. I cannot um, 
maybe tied to the military thing, but I cannot end this video without saying a very solemn and necessary rest in peace to Sam and Roger Fortson, um, 24 years old, life gone, been on my mind heavy all day, um, it's kind of been hard for me to shake it, plan on doing some stuff to tribute him and commemorate him in the very near future, so if you know me from a personal level, you'll see it, if not, you'll hear about it some way, somehow, but Appreciate y'all listening. Appreciate y'all rocking with me, man. More to come. I got a review of this game disc on the way. <laughs> I, I'll i save my thoughts for that one for later. Um, but that's it, man. Shout out to y'all, man. Appreciate it. Keep rocking. If you ever wonder, man, if we ever going to be down bad because we can't get, you know, Travis Scott shock drops and relief, man, look, understand. I'll go without. Understand that we go. <laughs>